Bravo, Joe Biden. You know who really caused this war between Russia and Ukraine is Joe Biden because of how weak this person has been with his vice president Kamala Harris, a joke of a puppet. And really, it's all of you guys who elected this person to be your president in which he was not able to handle diplomatic foreign affairs properly. You need to take ownership of everything, right? We need to take ownership and broaden the scope of things which are really within our influence of control. When I took a look at Trump when he was president, he was buddy buddy with Putin and he was working on all these business partnerships, keeping this delicate balance of power. And then Joe Biden gets elected in by pretty much by you guys and other countries like China and Russia come in and feel like, you know what, they can take him. Right, Joe Biden doesn't really know what he's doing and more so we too must take responsibility and ownership for really what we have done to this world. Now I did not elect Joe Biden, okay? But you guys out there, the blood is on your hands. I want you to, to stop pointing fingers at other people saying is that person's fault, is this person's fault, it is your fault for electing this person who was not able to maintain the peace of the world. Now with that aside, am I going to condemn this war? Am I going to virtue signal for you guys over on Twitter and send my thoughts on prayers? You know, I would say that if you really care, if this really meant something for you, then you would get on the ground and organize some protests in your city and actually do something instead of sitting around on Twitter, virtue signaling in your armchair. Now, as for me, I know nothing about Russia or Ukraine. I mean, come on, I'm American. I don't even know where these countries are. So I'm not going to pretend to understand any of these situations or have context on that. And so personally for me, I'm not sure I want to just go in and inject my own Western values and cultures into other countries. Maybe it's their business. Maybe they know what they're doing. Maybe Russia's even right. I really wouldn't know. I mean, I'm sure there's many people in Ukraine who even support Russia, who want to be liberated by Russia and many people who don't. So I'm not going to comment on the politics of this, but 